Well, I came in up here this morning and I just couldn't help but notice how nice Honey Baby's sewing room looks. I know I shot a video of it right after we finished it, but uh, I stuck my head in the, here this morning. These are all little quilt patterns she's got laid out over here and some of her other patterns over here. And she hung that cool picture on the wall, which I think really fits in nice up here. And then over here, she's got her another quilt laid out that she's working on and you know like I say I just walked by this morning she was in here working and I just kind of came by to say hi and I looked in here and I thought man that room looks really cool now so I thought I'd share that with y'all most of you or a lot of you watched uh, me and Josh build this room or rebuild this room and uh, so I wanted to give you a kind of a I don't know uh, another look and let you see what it looks like now that she's in here working and enjoying it so there's that hope y'all having a great day bye now now you've got an addition say that again what but you were just saying I was showing people that how your room oh, I said I love the setup because I can sit at the sewing machine and I reach across to the table and grab pins or I grab something or I put something over there. I've got a table beside the sewing machine. I can lay finished stuff over there. I love the setup. It's just awesome, ain't it? I love it. Now, it's, it's awesome. Just as I was considering making this video, you went upstairs and hung more pictures up I there. did. You want to show us? I did. Okay, let's go yes. have a look. Come on. Because I was just thinking, well, I just shot, I just shot a video. I know, and now it looks different. And now she's up there doing something new. I was just doing a video one Decorative. Well, I do have more wall space. Uh -huh. I do. So, I was just explaining the significance of my choices. Well, you want to tell us about it? Yep. The one top left yeah. is the one that started T's Homegrown Photos. That was the first photo that I printed on canvas and framed. Yeah. Uh, so that's very significant. You know, the next one, of course, is Pomaquid, which we always like. We always go to visit. Yeah. Uh, and then I had to put up my bright Black Eyed Susans just to pop a little yellow on that wall. Oh, they so cute. Yeah. yeah. And then over there, uh -huh. that top one was... I remember that. Yes, our bed and breakfast weekend up at Acadia when we went biking. Yeah, we took the bikes up there. That we was had awesome. The bikes. I like that picture. And that was shot, and that's, I think that was shot right through the window there. It was. We yeah. were having breakfast. Yeah. Yep, so I love that one. That one down there was taken down in Virginia, which is a favorite place when we go to visit the kids and grandkids out at uh, Sandy Bottom. Yeah, I remember that. Yep, so I went there kayaking when I went in June. And then that one, of course, is of Acadia, my very, very favorite place in the whole world. Cool. Acadia National Park. So when I'm up here, I can now look at, you know, all these great pictures and have wonderful memories from all of them. And I uh, hope it doesn't diminish this big one. But I think that one pretty much stands by itself. <laughs> you took all those pictures? Yes. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, this picture was taken when we did our first motorcycle ride. Am I wrong about that? No, no, no. I'm wrong about that. That was up at Presque Isle. Yeah. When I went up to Presque Isle. And that one is like, I, I say photoshopped, but it was done through Picasso. Uh -huh. It wasn't done through Photoshop, but. Great. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. All righty then. I love it. Oh, you know what? I'll do one of those photos where you turn the camera all the way around. Panoramic. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to try that. Okay. I'll stop the video.